A warm, wonderful welcome. My name is Victor Zamet. I'm a retired attorney. I have been investigating the afterlife now for more than 20 years using scientific method. Quantum physics. There is a revolution in the world today by quantum physics scientists. These quantum physics scientists are leaving behind those close-minded orthodox scientists who think they can use outmoded and outdated science to support their materialistic and mechanistic view of a universe without the afterlife, without the paranormal. But the first, before we move on to quantum physics. I'd just like to remind you that closed-minded orthodox scientists have been a big problem, big hindrance to science itself and to progress generally. They even rejected some of the most brilliant discoveries and innovations uh, in history. Just a couple of examples to illustrate this point. Number one, these closed-minded orthodox scientists fully supported the theological establishment in the 17th century to viciously oppose the greatest scientist of his time, Galileo, who told them all, Earth is not in the center of the universe. And he explained to them his heliocentric view of the solar system. Number two. Of course, there was these uh, closed-minded scientists who allied with their journal Scientific American, and there were others like uh, the uh, top army scientists and the, some intellectuals and academics, and even this professor of mathematics and astronomy, Simon Newcomb. Now, all heaped ridicule, all heaped insults, on the two of the greatest inventors of all times, the Wright brothers. And this professor said, listen carefully, he said, it is scientifically impossible for machines to fly. <laughs> now, if we listen to these uh, closed-minded scientists, we'd still be going to England by ship. Number three more opposition to great inventions in history. For example, you have Professor Henry Morton, Professor Dumoncel, and we have that uh, great British closed-minded orthodox scientist Sir William Priest and others like him who called uh, Edison, the greatest fraud in history. And we know Edison invented the electric globe, who revolutionized industry. <laughs> if we listen to these closed-minded uh, scientists, we'd still be reading in candlelight in the evening. Number four. For over 100 years, closed-minded orthodox medical scientists ridiculed acupuncture, said it's Chinese quackery. But today, a hundred years later, some of these top Western medical scientists say that in some instances acupuncture is far more advanced than anything we have in the West today. Over the last few decades, there has been significant research done in quantum physics which is the study of the characteristics of and relationships between subatomic particles and energies. What is revolutionary in quantum physics is now that these quantum physics scientists are showing that what is paranormal is really normal and is consistent with the laws of science. So now I'd like you to read very carefully what some of these brilliant quantum physics scientists have to say.